Hey, what's up everybody? This is Daniel Sun. I'm here today to do a review on, it is called At the Beach by Bath and Body Works. But before I tell you my thoughts and feelings about this and tell you what it's like, I want to give, I want to say a couple of things. First, I want to give a shout out to one of my really good friends here in YouTube land. His name is Veritas Vincent. Um, my last review um, towards the end, I had a bunch of fragrances that I've been wanting to do and I was asking if y'all want to see one of these, let me know and I'll do it next. Well, he was the one, Vin uh, Veritas Vincent was the one who picked this. So I want to give a shout out to you, Vincent. Uh, Veritas, thank you very much. I've actually, I think actually now is a good time to do this because summer's coming up pre pretty soon before we know it, but how is everybody today? I hope everybody's doing well. I'm actually doing pretty good today. Um, another thing is, tell me what fragrance you're wearing right at this moment when you see this uh, review. I'm actually having three fragrances today. Um, before I went to work today, I decided I wanted to wear L'Homme Ideal by Guerlain. This is actually a really killer fragrance. Um, and of course now, or getting ready to, I'm gonna go ahead and spray this on. Um, right now, I am wearing At The Beach by Bath & Body Works. And tonight, before I go to bed, I always like to wear a fragrance right before bed. I've always been that way. But I chose Perry Ellis Oud Black Vanilla Absolute for tonight, um, Betty Time fragrance. So I'm gonna wear that before I go to bed tonight. Another thing I wanted to say is, I'm still going to do fragrance reviews, but I wanted to sort of do some different things also. Um, I was thinking today, I think some of the houses and some of the perfumers sort of get overlooked because there's so many reviewers now and they're doing just fragrances. A lot of people don't ever talk about the houses or the perfumers. So I'm going to start doing a little series um, on the perfumers and the houses themselves, sort of like a history you know, the background to the perfumer, the background to the house, like, uh, for instance, Guerlain, I can do a, uh, I can start with Guerlain, and two of my favorite perfumers are uh, Nathalie Lorison, and um, I can start doing um, some videos on the perfumers themselves. Um, Terry Wassa, for Guerlain, he's one of my favorites too. Um, but anyway, let me tell you about this at the beach by Bath and Body Works. Um, I've always, always loved the smell of Coppertone suntan oil, always. And about four or five months ago, that, that smell was on my mind for some reason. So I went to some of the Facebook groups and asked around. I was like, is there a fragrance that smells like that old school copper tone Santan oil? I got a few responses back. And one of the main responses I got back was there's a fragrance called Fire Island by Bond Number no. 9. So I went to their website and looked and it was like, ah, that does sort of sound like it might smell like that, but it was too expensive and I didn't get it. And I sort of forgot about um, getting a fragrance or trying to find a fragrance that smells like um, suntan oil. But about a month ago, a month and a half ago, I was at work and it was really cold outside. It was like 45 degrees and it was like raining and cloudy and windy. But I was going out to the lobby and there was this girl that passed me about three feet, three or four feet away. She passed me coming into my store and I got this big old whiff of like, it smelled exactly like copper toned suntan oil. 
And I was like, that smells exactly like that suntan oil I love. And I was like, well, I was like, I thought about it for a minute. I was like, she couldn't have been at the beach because it was like 45 degrees and it was raining. It was really bad weather that day. And I was like, I wonder if that could actually be like a fragrance, like a eau de toilette or something. So I, I had to find out. So I went and found her. I was like, do you have like suntan oil on or something? And she was like, no. I was like, well, what is it? And she was like, it's called At the Beach by Bath and Body Works. And I was like, well, that smells exactly like copper tone suntan oil. And she was like, I know. That's why I got it. And I was like, I got to find out about this. So I went home that night and went to Bath and Body Works website and found it and ordered it. And the day that I got it, before I even sprayed it on, I was looking at the bottle, which is actually a really cool bottle. And it's got a fantastic spray. It sprays out a lot of juice. But before I even sprayed it on, I was looking at the bottle. And I was like, this is a really cool bottle. And I noticed it said, fine fragrance mist. I was like, crap. I was like, it's a body spray, so it's not going to last but an hour. But anyway, I sprayed it on. And I was like, this is it. It smells like suntan oil. But the funny thing about this fragrance is um, when you smell it, ah, that smells good. When you smell it up close on your arm, especially right after you spray it, it does smell like suntan oil, especially with that coconut. It's got a really good coconut in here. But for some reason, when you smell it, up close on yourself, it smells a little bit more feminine and a little bit more floral than suntan oil. But when somebody else has it on or you have it on and you're not sniffing it up close, it smells almost identical to copper tone suntan oil. So I thought that was cool. But let me give you the notes. The notes are white plumeria, toasted coconut, bergamot essence, saltwater breeze aloe mist now plumeria is a floral note that smells a little bit like jasmine and tropical fruit and one thing i find interesting is they actually incorporated aloe mist into the fragrance itself um, because i think the majority of people that will use this are going to use it in the summertime outside when it's like really sunny and nice outside so I thought that was cool that they put aloe in here so that way it'll sort of keep your skin it'll help your skin stay or keep moisturized and maybe a little bit protected from the sun but yeah I just wanted to bring every this to everybody's attention because um, yeah I've been in search of a fragrance that smells like copper tone suntan oil and I finally found it um, but it's the longevity or the performance is actually, I was actually surprised about this because when I read that it was a body mist or a body spray, I was like, crap, man, it's not going to last, but like maybe an hour, but I'm actually getting a good, probably about four hours solid longevity on this. And the projection and scent trail is actually pretty good too. Um, because when she passed me that day, she was like three or four feet from me, and I got a big whiff of like that suntan oil smell. So the performance is actually really good on this, considering it's a um, body spray, because I have some Eau de Toilettes that doesn't perform this well. Um, but the price on this is actually good, too. This is a eight fluid ounce. This is a big bottle. Um... And on their website, they have it for $14.50, $14.50 for an 8-fluid ounce. And even if their performance, even if their performance isn't as good on you as it is me, I mean, still for 8-fluid ounces for $14, bucks, if it only lasts you like three hours, just spray some more on and it'll last you another couple of more hours. No big deal. And they also actually have another deal um, and I think it's actually, um, a deal that they have all the time. If you buy three, you get two of something free. So I actually ended up getting two of these, which is a total of 
16 fluid ounces um, and I got another one that looks exactly like this same size and everything it's called I think it's called coconut breeze or something it's actually supposed to smell like virgin island water or something similar to that and I actually ended up getting two other things which was like free um, but it's actually a pretty good deal considering you know the performance on me is actually outstanding for a body mess but I'll put the link in the description on where you can um, get this in the description so if you're interested but anyway I just uh, yeah it's getting close to summer and if you want to smell like copper tone suntan oil without getting oily crap on you this is a good you know alternative anyway I will talk to you guys later and I hope everybody has a good day love you guys bye